Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jacqueline. I'm making videos every week, a whole variety of things, lifestyle, beauty, adventure, all sorts of fun stuff. So I hope you consider subscribing and joining our little adventure family here. And today I have a teeny tiny little Amazon haul specifically for travel stuff for our baby. So we have a big trip coming up here soon. I'm super excited for it. We're going to Disney, I'm so excited. Um, but I just needed a few other things for him to travel with. Um, I'll link a video where I talk about a few other things I got for travel from our first trip with our baby up in the corner and down below. But I talk about things like um, we got gate check bags for our stroller and our car seat. Um, we got another carrier for him, which is great. We have two different carriers. So just depending on what we're doing, you know um what else did i talk about in there i don't remember all but I, like i said i'll link that up in the corner and down below in case you're curious about some of the other stuff we already have for him but these are just a few kind of like florida warm weather specific things for the baby as well as a new stroller for disney which is very exciting so let's talk about the stroller first so i'm gonna pop a picture up of it here maybe i'll get like a little clip of it in action but we have this cool craft little stroller thing it opens and closes one hand which is great it's only 12 pounds again which is great and it's much easier to fold up and carry than our big stroller so i love our big stroller we have um what kind do we have i don't remember what brand we have but we have like a bigger travel system stroller that like the car seat can click in and out of um oh it's a gray co one i don't remember the exact one though but it's a gray co one and like it's great but it's just really big and kind of hard to carry, especially if you're carrying other things or the baby or whatever. And when you're in Disney, if you get on any of the buses, you have to collapse your stroller. So I was just thinking about that. And you know, just like travel in general would be easier with a lighter weight, a little bit more compact stroller. So this one definitely isn't the most compact out there. There are actually ones out there that fold so small you can put them in overhead bins on airplanes. We didn't need anything like that. I just wanted something a little bit smaller, a little bit easier to carry, and something I could open and close with one hand. Honestly, looking back at like when I register and stuff, I wish I had just registered for a travel stroller to begin with, because there's actually one from Graco that our car seat would have clicked into um, that literally you just like pull up through the middle with one hand. It's super light, it'd be so easy, but we didn't do that. So now we have two strollers, which is fine. We can keep one in each car then too. Um, but this has been great. I've tested it out already. I took it to Target, taken it to the grocery store. It's been great. I was able to open and close it one-handed while holding the baby. He fits in it great. He really enjoys it. It's nice and lightweight, easy to push. Um, the only thing I will say is our diaper bag doesn't fit underneath, but we just use the little um, stroller clips and just hang it over the handle the where you push the push it from and it works fine. It's great. Um, so it's going to be perfect for Disney, perfect for travel in general. I'm really excited that we got another stroller. It's a little bit lightweight, a little bit easier. Um, I will say also our Graco one was great when he was really little because he was still in his car seat. So um, that was easy to take in the airport because we didn't, obviously he couldn't sit like upright in a car seat when we first traveled with him. He's only three months old. So that was great when we were traveling with him when he was really, really little. But now that he can sit up on his own and he can sit like in a full-size stroller, it's just going to be easier to travel with something a little bit more compact, a little bit light, lighter weight, and a little bit easier to carry around. So really excited about that. Uh, the other thing we got for the stroller is this fan. I didn't realize how small this fan is, but I think it's going to be perfect. I've already tested it out, like just holding up to myself, and it's very powerful um i'll link all this stuff down below but this is basically just a portable fan with these little twisty arms so you can kind of twist it around something hold on to a stroller it charges via usb it has three different speeds so nice and low kind of medium and then the high setting is really strong like i don't know if you can see my hair is moving there but like it is like it's strong and like I said, um, it's USB charged. So we can take our portable charger with us or whatever and charge us up like on the go throughout the day. You know, maybe like at lunchtime or whatever we can charge. I didn't look to see how long it says it lasts. Um, I'd have to like read the instructions, but I think this is gonna be perfect. Again, it's so lightweight and compact. You can kind of 
you know, fold it up so it fits in the diaper bag a little bit easier, but then also just twist it around, you know, the handle of the stroller to keep the baby nice and cool. Um, these slots aren't too big that he can like stick his fingers through there or anything. And just in the hot Florida weather, it'd be nice to be like, have a fan on him at all times just to keep him a little bit more comfortable. Obviously he's not gonna be wearing like heavy clothes or anything. And I'll talk about a few other things that will hopefully help keep him cool and comfortable. But um, yeah, this seems like it's gonna be great. I'm really excited to try it out and stuff. And like I said, it should be good. It did come with um, its own charging cable too, which is nice. So it's just a USB little charging cable, but I can just throw this again in the diaper bag with a portable charging block thing and he'll be set for the day to be cool, which is really nice. Oh, this also like twists, which was nice. I didn't realize that, that's cool. Um, so yeah, very excited about this. This had great reviews on Amazon. So again, just like perfect for a warm weather trip with a baby. Um, something else I got to keep him cool was new bucket hats. So I got, this is a set of two. And I just thought these were really cute. They have a little smiley face on them. They have a drawstring in the back around the head so you can kind of adjust it to make it smaller to fit around a smaller head or bigger to fit as they get older. So it's nice that it'll be able to grow with him. The one we had before was like a specific size and it's just too small now. This one will last a little bit longer. Um, I got this gray one and a blue one as a set of two, like I said. And then I also love the little drawstring here at the bottom. His old one kind of like Velcroed underneath and it was just really hard to like get it onto him. So it's nice that this one's very simple and easy. And I also love how wide of a brim this is. It's really gonna keep him nice and shaded and keep the sun off his face and some of his shoulders and stuff. I just think it's gonna be great for again, Florida, sunny weather, anything like that, obviously. Um, want to keep him protected from that Florida sun and we live in Colorado so it'd be great you know just for walking around here too just to keep that sun off him. He should be old enough by the time we go that he'll be able to have sunscreen but I still don't you know want to make sure he's protected from the sun as much as possible. So this will be great like I said I got this gray one and a dark blue one um, but they had a ton of different color options and stuff so Super fun. I just thought the little smiley face was a really cute little touch. So love that. And the last thing I got to kind of keep it, the sun out of his eyes and stuff are sunglasses. So these are from Coco Stand Baby and they're just little Wayfair sunglasses. They are so cute. They have a little strap. I'll pop a picture of them up of him wearing them actually. They fit great. They're really like flexible. The strap back here is adjustable. So, you know, they're really just like perfect for a baby. Um, he has worn them a few times now and doesn't seem to be bothered by them. Every once in a while, he'll pull them down or try to stick them in his mouth. But for the most part, he leaves them on. He seems to like them. Um, he does have blue eyes. And if they're anything like mine, my blue eyes are super sensitive to the sun. So I wanted to make sure I had some protection for his sun eyes in, in the bright light, obviously. Like I said, again, we're going to try to keep him out of the sun as much as possible and, you know, keep him protected. But we're going to be in Florida. We're going to be in and out of the sun a lot. So it's just so nice to be able to have a little pairs of sunglasses. And these are just so, so cute. They came with a little carrying case and their own little cloth. He actually needs to clean them because, again, he tries to put them in his mouth. But, um, yeah, I just think they're perfect. They look super cute. They fit him pretty well now. He's just turned six months old. And they fit him pretty well now, but I think he'll still have a few more months and stuff with these at this size. So that's perfect. Yeah, and they're just great. He loves to wear them. I put them on him during our walks and stuff. So that way his little eyes are protected and they're just great. And they come with, like I said, this little protective bag. So love, love, love these. And then the last thing I got, which is very specific to like a warm weather trip, or maybe if you live somewhere warm and you want to be able to go to the pool with your baby and float. I got a little inflatable thing for him. This is um, a lay cool one. So you can either put him laying forward so his face is kind of here, or you can put his back of his head here too. So he's kind of facing up. Um, I'll put up a picture of him again in this thing. He loved this. I tried this out in our baby. I'm gonna put it down because it's jingling. Um, there's little bells inside. Um, 
I put him in that in our little baby pool and he loved it. He just kind of floated around and looked around and he just loved it. It was he, it was just so much fun. He looked very secure in it. It also came with a little like canopy thing, like this thing that you can attach to it. I didn't attach it when I used it outside just because of um, it, where he was was already in the shade. But this will be great to be able to, you know, give him some protection. I'm pretty sure this is UPF 50, same with the hat. Um, so, you know, he's got some sun protection there. It comes with a hand pump, so it's really easy to inflate and get to the right size and stuff. So, yeah, I'm really excited about this. I'm excited that I got an inflatable one because that way I can deflate it. It's easy to pack. It's not taking up too much room or anything like that. And then it comes with a hand pump, so it's easy to reinflate. And it just works great. Obviously, he's not going to fit in this for very long, but... It'll be perfect for this trip and a little bit after if it's still like nice enough to be in our little baby pool and stuff. But it is great if you're looking for an easy portable float for a baby. This one's great and he just loved it. He loves the water. So this is just like perfect for him. Yeah, and I'm really excited to take it with us and try it out of the pool at Disney. So that's everything I got him. Like I said, it wasn't a lot of stuff. We already had some stuff from our first trip that we took with him. But we just wanted a few more things just to kind of, you know, make sure we were all set. Um, and so far, we love all this stuff. It's been really, really good, really convenient. I'm just, we're so excited for our trip. So hopefully you guys find that helpful. If you have any like travel recommendations for baby, things you love, you have to have when you travel with your baby, let me know what it is. Leave it down below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, don't forget to visit don't forget to subscribe. We would love to have you join our little adventure family here. And yeah, I think that's it for this video. So I'll see you in my next adventure. Bye.